We cut MDF tops, plasterers came in, they seal it first, they lay the cement on, and they can do it to any finish you like, so you can have it rough or smooth or a little bit rough. This goes on pretty much as high as you can get it. So you want it one, probably one to two mil max. But you want to keep it as tight as you can. Discrepancies you cause in this coat will show through the, the second coat. So you kind of want to be a bit ununiform. This is micro cement. So, so is it cement based or is it polymer It is cement based, yes. It's, um, I think it's actually got granules of, I think it's marble. Oh, so it's it? marble so powder use. So it's, it's, it's a lot stronger than uh, your generic sand and cement. So you're plasterers by trade, yeah? By trade, yeah. yeah. Plasterers by trade. To this because just well yeah. we've both interest, really. both originally started as a uh, in art oh, really? yeah and we've uh, kind of wanted to express our our art through plastering and, and this is kind of the best best path to follow yeah so rather than just doing day after day of or whatever. That's it. A bit more Something a bit more challenging, a yeah. bit more different, a bit more creative. So you went on a course to learn it? Yeah, so there's a, there's a company in North, North London that teach it. Uh, they, they supply all our, all our stuff as well. And um, yeah, done, done the course with them and, and bit by bit learning different techniques and different application methods. So what do you think is the most challenging job you've done so far with it? Uh, we've done nice garden walls, right. about 100 square metres of garden walls because the uh, material can be used outside in all weathers. I wasn't expecting that, I was expecting you to say something along the lines of uh, showering or bathroom or whatever. Yeah, no, we, you can do it obviously in a, in a, in a shower enclosure or like you said a full bathroom yeah. it's fully waterproof but now we've done a nice nice garden garden walls around a, a swimming pool and that's um that come out really nice we've done a a base coat first yeah. a similar base coat today that they use to the um, external wall insulations the cater end and, and such yeah. so we use that kind of base coat with the mesh and then straight over it with uh, the micro cement Obviously, if the customer's happy to, to leave it for at least two to three days once the, the final seal has gone on, just so everything, everything is fully absorbed. And, yeah. and from then on, it should be pretty good to, pretty good to go. So, so just talk us through, you, you, you're doing this, you did the primer last night. So yeah. the primer went on last night, yeah. and then we do one coat now, flatten off, as you get on that one, flatten off. 
and then we wait a while two to three hours usually but in this heat it's going to be a lot quicker um, and then we'll apply a second one again flatten it off again because it's a kitchen you want it as smooth and as, as nice and sealed as possible once that's dry overnight come back apply what they call a link which enhances all the the color of the oh, micro cement nice. they've chosen leave that to dry again and then you apply your uh, your top sealant which so is that be one more day visit or would you have to do it, that? it'd probably be another day visit yeah yeah, yeah so. spaced out the supplier provided us with a a color chart that they can provide they can also match any color but it incurs a, yeah. a heavier cost yeah. but um the general the general colors they, they tend because it's a micro cement and it's it's more of an industrial kind of product they tend to go for a lot of an earthier color or natural more natural colors They lay the cement on and they can do it to any finish you like. So you can have it rough or smooth or a little bit rough. This, this is sort of halfway between. And uh, it looks nice, it, it looks like natural stone. And um, it's waterproof, heat resistant. Um, really, it's a, it's a good option and it comes in a variety of colors as well. So it's, it's, it's worked out really well. And, it, and it, it does come in quite a bit cheaper than quartz or granite. All right. Um, obviously, being that it's MDF to start yeah, with, even allowed for their labour. Yeah, and the, I mean the, the labour. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it, it took them a day to do everything in here and the utility, uh, and then they just pop back the next evening to give it a coat of sealer, and then the following evening to give it a, another sealer for the heat protection, and, and that's it. Job's done. Yeah.